so there's a lot of fighting going on here sanctum is trying to pass to the enemy tower i already managed to click on it so i am they didn't stop me this time so i'm gonna try to do some damage to it although it has plenty of life uh, unlike our tower 19 and a half thousand um uh, damage there on the first attack another critical unfortunately not there but the most important is to get a double attack with the ultimate slasher now i hope it does go through at 17,000 and the ultimate delphic destroyer uh sorry the delphic destroyer not the ultimate of course is coming through now with hopefully some criticals not so strong I do manage to survive another turn for double attack on ultimate slasher and this is going to be a pretty decent round against the tower oh, I survived one more I wasn't expecting that so that is indeed very good of course um, dying there but 151 guild battle points pretty solid damage to the tower and that's basically what you want because you see now sanctum getting 40 points fairy 63 but the more damage you do to the enemy tower of course the more points you are getting and ours has only 25 million uh, life left out of 600 we are 500 points behind as i read in the chat um, it also could be that not so many people from our um, guild are using potions but i think uh, on both sides everybody is using potions because it's such an intense battle here on the left side finally that assault team got challenged so we're probably going to take that tower back we're now looking at 2v2 uh, two towers on each side but it's not going to be enough we'd have to take all the four towers from now on which probably is not going to happen there's no way we can take all the four towers with so many of the fairies um, um, being so active um, let's try to click I did click on the tower I did manage to pass through so I'm gonna try to have another successful uh, round with the tower which is of course a little bit dependent on luck opening up with ultimate slasher here unfortunately without any critical let's go with a double attack with a slasher um, that will work that's not a problem again no critical though um, double attack with the ultimate slasher hopefully will work that is important to get another 17,000 those 17,000 are quite important the delphic will also pass through hopefully with some criticals that that is also something that we need and and now another double attack with the ultimate slasher should be the last i don't think i will survive another round like last time but again very nice criticals i did survive one more round 300 health only left so that went another successful round with 251,000 final damage done by the tower it looks like the battle is over if i understood it correctly no it is not yet over uh, we are still in it but 157,000 guild battle points for that um, getting some message or the mines are already expired the battle has been going on for so long if i look at the ti uh, timer here i'm recording already 45 minutes straight um, so we still have 13 minutes to go for the battle um, and we did manage to um, recover and take three towers now so we're back to where we were at the beginning of the of the fight but that is uh, we're gonna have to keep that uh, for quite a while and possibly take all the four towers um, and at the same time attack um, their main tower to try to make that difference but we need several people uh, like myself doing those kind of damages to the enemy tower i just got intercepted unfortunately by linear this time i don't remember if one on one i can kill him 2300 600 i don't think that's enough we're gonna go with uh, with the ultimate and try to finish him home faster but e314 is already saying that he can just sit here and look at each other for a while because he feels so confident um arwen here joining the battle with no life whatsoever which is of course ridiculous because he's not helping the guild at all by not buying any life uh, yeah she's saying sorry because she realized that um but we are going to drop down here because we have uh, a whirlwind uh, two multi shots although one of the multi shots has been closed down um, my shield is going to come through but lilo can definitely help as long as lilo survives we still have a chance for that uh, e314 is challenging that is not going to be turned around still people are fighting to make it happen 
um, where where for uh, I can't see his name did manage to survive with just a little bit of life everybody is hanging on just on the last lives there the ultimate um, slasher from Ximi normally would take somebody down um, unfortunately the uh, Kalisa's attack was not strong enough so we got Kirito there taking me down to just uh, the very bare minimum uh, life uh, I'm wondering if I should use uh, let's use a healing rune and and see if we can survive uh, a little longer all I need is for my shield to come in 20 seconds or so uh, gonna try to use a Delphic destroyer see if I can come out of this um, I'm just practically on no life standing there um, some luck with a Delphic might do it not quite sure starting to lag here and I did bring Kirito down to almost no life but I am down and I don't think Kalesa is strong enough especially with that shield he's going to use holy seal to stun her uh, to hold her for one or two turns and then he's gonna finish her off even though he has no life left so this was an interesting battle but of course it took all of us out of the um, out of the loop and so we couldn't go and attack the enemy tower um, and those attacks were very very important to try to breach that gap of 500 points so fair is victorious in this battle I did get 70,000 guild battle points for that but still time is running out only 10 minutes or less than 10 minutes left I'm gonna try to reset the Templars uh, as I am running uh, because of course the reason you need to reset them and you need to reset them each fight is not to lose them and having to recruit them because the tower battles are of course taking down the Templars in one hit each um, and if you would allow the whole thing to uh, all the Templars to go into battle then uh, of course it's not going to come out well fairies do manage to take back uh, three towers now so it's looking again quite dire for Sanctum but the point gap has been breached we are at 5300 against 5552 so we are no longer at 500 gap we are at much weaker the chicken trying to intercept me I'm doing some kind of a weird zigzag maneuver um, which does manage to throw him off I did manage to reach the tower so all I need is now to do another successful attack their tower is actually getting lower and lower on health so who knows if we can keep doing this we can get all those crazy points would be really really useful hopefully a double attack from ultimate slasher will come through but this time it didn't work so I actually lost an entire turn and that's why of course that's a little bit dependent on luck to get those double attacks through uh, so gonna do a delphic now hopefully with some cre one critical there and ultimate slasher and this time also was not a double attack so this was a semi failed uh, round still any damage done is good but of course you could see this was not even comparable to the previous two runs still 122,000 123,000 guild battle points came in for that fight and uh, some decent damage was still done even though it was not the most successful I am now on a uh, 10th ranking uh, with the contribution 1.17 million contribution here on the 10th ranking if I can get a couple of more of those successful guild um, uh, um, tower runs I will definitely stay on that top 10 table uh, which would be good but m more than that it would be good to get some additional points for Sanctum to try to win we have seven and a half minutes left roughly speaking um, but we are um, about 300 points below now and it's looking more and more like fairies are going to win we have 36 points for sanctum and 65 points for fairies coming in at the last uh, score mark we have Tsu here shouting uh, go go fairies in the world chat even um, Got, got intercepted here again with uh, Belanda opening up with the ultimate Delphic destroyer trying to finish Liliana as fast as possible um, we have here uh, Shisuna joining in uh, helping Liliana but of course that ultimate slasher uh, ultimate Delphic was too weak far too weak uh, so he will not be able to support very much a black whore can support but there is the the delphic from liliana now coming in and of course it's going to hit me instead 
So it's time to go for a whirlwind to try to bring down more. We got, let's see, we got uh, a bit strange players for the fairy. So normally we should be able to beat them. But I am now with two weaker players. And Black War is um, a decent player. So we are basically two strong knights. Uh, we should be able to hold this. Of course, the top knight there seems to be the strongest one. Um, I forgot to click my skill there in all the commentary but here comes um, an ultimate slasher and a slasher that's a very nice 10,000 damage from black War. Um, I should probably put up a shield so they don't take me down uh, still a nitro going down so maybe the shield is not going to happen um, the entrance about the bell ground is about to start 13,000 damage uh, they're finishing off the barrel so this is a good mini victory for Sanctum but of course this doesn't give you any points this was just pre uh, kind of designed to block us from reaching the enemy tower so uh, again running through we have to reset the Templars again every battle which is quite annoying but again we got intercepted uh, with Astadur who totally ran out of health now of course with so much fighting and so much damage everybody is running out of health um, there is order after order to attack the enemy tower uh, which we are trying to do but it is very difficult there's so many defenders um, using up all the rage that we got and not every time we're passing through 101 points for Sanctum you see that people are actually uh, seriously attacking the, the um, enemy tower and perhaps we should have done that right from the beginning and beaten them um, that way uh, I think that would have been uh, looking back retrospectively that would have been a better idea to just everybody going uh, for that Venom is saying we're only 150 points uh, below which of course is not huge 150 points is something that if the top players uh, of our guild would attack the tower we could easily make it 117 points coming in from sanctum 30 points for fairy so we're only 79 points now below um, that does indicate that some of the top players like gargamel are uh, and deja vu perhaps i don't know if he's in but dai also if they just change their attention and um, and instead of trying to take towers if they all just go for the enemy tower we can win this it's now 5978 points versus 6050 it is so close i think everybody should go for that i'm gonna try to put that in the chat uh let's try um i think everyone <laughs> should attack their tower so um everybody has to do that um because then we get we get those big points in in just two minutes everybody um if, if only all the top people only 61 points coming through sanctum but still more than the fairy tales um so it's really really close I, it's an epic battle like like it was promised to be um so here we go we have one one two three people attacking our tower but we have a lot more attacking their tower so so let's see if we can pass through it's now just an exchange of damage of who can do more which uh, which guild has the strongest damage damage output 6105 against 6157 is so many points never on this server people have been getting all those points so let's try to pass through and support if i can just reach the tower i can also support that effort of course um it is just crazy now i cannot even get to the tower it is there it is i think i managed to to get in there um and i did so if i just have one more successful round with the tower it will definitely help 7700 damage there coming in for, from the critical double attack from the slasher with a critical 12,000 coming through uh, i think this time the ultimate slasher double attack did work it's going to be followed up with a critical that was really good and a delphic destroyer so kind of the same routine but it is very very difficult to hit the, uh, the keys exactly at the right times to get those things through 
and as long as it keeps going like it is going with the double attacks 19,700 critical there didn't survive the last round but another 154,000 guild battle points that effort definitely if many more of those happen we can definitely win this 6,315 against 6,343 it is so close it is so difficult uh, to predict who can take this it is really close it's only one minute remaining there's only 30 points difference um, we are stuck at the spawn I think if I do manage to get there I will only make it uh, one last time there's only enough time for just one time and the guild bell is over and I think let's see let's see the chat because I don't know actually who won and it looks like Sanctum has defeated the fairies. I can't believe it. I'm trying to scroll. It's impossible. Everybody trying to speak in the chat. Sanctum has earned more points. It's unbelievable. We win with 700, 700 honor. And everybody on top 10 also, uh, including myself, I seem to have managed to be on top 10. It is really epic. The chat is going crazy with um, with emotions. Everybody is extremely tired and happy um so let's also join join in straight away uh thank thank fairies so let me give me a second thank you fairies for the fantastic guild battle epic unbelievable so there we go that was a really good battle I thought last second they actually had more points I'm gonna have to go back in the video and have a look at that uh, I thought it was 30 points above for the fairies but looks like not um, looks like at the last second there uh, Sanctum did manage to pass through um, and <laughs> yeah uh, I'm going to definitely upload the video for um, definitely let me just definitely <laughs> um, so that is going to be uh, there for everybody to watch um, and this was really a very very uh, important battle for the server uh, today was the day when they were supposed to dethrone sanctum and take us off but going back to the score screen we can see that that did not happen sanctum has beaten fairy tales we have managed to stay the kings of the server since the beginning since the birth we are still the best uh, we are still number one and we are going to have another challenge next week most likely unless fairies get uh, very demotivated and give up in fighting i hope they don't so we have another fantastic battle next week Hope you guys enjoyed that long battle it was a whole hour of recording and commentary so i'm also tired from that um, thanks for watching i uh, everybody who enjoyed this please click on like on all the videos because it always helps click on subscribe to my channel check out my blog share these videos with your friends and in your guild and in your guild websites and forums um, thank you very much. Hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Thanks for watching.